What's up you guys and welcome back to the channel. Finally got to paint the garage after the disaster. Dark gray. It's coming out nice. Today we are taking the truck to Mando's paint. He's gonna start on the bed. He's gonna take the bed off, sandblast it, do body work, put the moldings back on, the SS kit. I will be taking this truck to the shootout this weekend, but it will be out there without a bed. I'm going to remove all this stuff that's all over the truck and pull the trailer out, load the truck up and head out to Mondo's Paint. If you haven't followed him on Instagram, give him a follow. He is the man. He is the guy to go for the SS kits, single cap, extended cap, crew cap, any kind of model truck. He's got it. He does all the uh, SS kits for all the trucks. With that being said, I'm gonna start removing all this, turn the truck on, get the truck out of here, and let's go. I just loaded up the truck by myself. This is the first time I had to do that with no help. It came out pretty even on both sides, so. I did good. So now I'm gonna start strapping it down. I have uh, axle straps, so I'm gonna do all four corners. So I won't scratch anything under the suspension because it's all power coated blue, so. I'm gonna get to it real quick. And I'm just waiting on Jonathan to get off from work. He should be out any minute now. So he can help me remove the bed once we get to the uh, painters because that bed is real freaking heavy. It might take about five guys to uh, be able to remove that bed and put it into a bed stand. So I got the truck strapped down all four corners. I dropped it down just a little bit, not all the way so it wouldn't lay and it will be rubbing on the trailer so i got it strapped down hola bato la llave maestra no es por delante no esta se va okay that's what you need right there. Oh yeah, that's what I need for the warning truck. You hit all my boys over there at Finesse real quick. Just got some shit. Akira. Finally it's here. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, no. You wanna back it in or la metemos de frente? Como tú que whenever you feel comfortable as si la pueden reversear. Okay. And then we can take the bed off and you know, take them out to Suez Parry otra vez. Yeah. Yeah, that's driving skills. Eh, it's a hot shot. Yeah, if you play. Same one now, eh? investigate mods we could do a soda blast okay soda blast it removes all the heavy rust mm -hmm. and doesn't do doesn't do any type of damage to the sheet metal oh really so we're gonna go ahead and do the soda blast complete yeah whatever works man. yeah it's pretty bad the rust is pretty bad and see seven ton jonathan I'll unload it right there. Get in there, bro. What's up? What's up? Jonathan. Get in there, bro. What's up? Break on the truck. 
Ja, ja. Sí, porque normalmente uno me agarró más el Rust West, way more on the bare, uh, bare metal and with a tack welded. Yeah. Y aquí hace que aquí adentro no no le granearon, so mm -hmm. it's gonna be coated mm -hmm. already with paint. So yeah, how hard I should work about that. Yeah, mm -hmm. we we gotta actually te digo te digo como we're estaba investigando what is best for this, and every single thing is telling me to do soda blast. Soda blast. What's the difference on that? And soda blast is more uh, sheet metal friendly, mm -hmm. which it will remove the actual rust out, and it will prevent from that coming up again. Mm -hmm. And there's less heat. Instead of the glass, uh, uh, it's a glass, and uh, that's another one that's uh, like a charcoal. It's a use para esto, but soda blast is the best one to use. Of course, we got to seam seal all this right here, mm -hmm. yeah, completely shut. Well, all this completamente. And I know certain areas we can seam seal it, like bien, but que todo dice ya Yeah, I mean, and then post, you know, body work like, like crazy. Yeah. On the side, aquí, porque se, se sumió cuando they were doing the right here, the gas door. Yeah. And then was the bed. Because, you know, whenever they started tack welding this, they're supposed to put a rag or something like that behind. Oh, that means I so thin. And uh, they put it on top, so se metió, se sumió. Mm -hmm. well, what do you think? Or can we cut the piece off? Uh, you know, we can hammer and dolly it out. Yeah. That's the like, concept when you put heat like this. Yeah. If you consistently mm -hmm. tack it, tack it, tack it, and without cooling it off, it's going to go to the least least path of resistance. So, yeah, aquí no tiene estructura compared to layer here. Yeah. And so, then lo que tiene que hacer is just tack weld it, cool it off, tack weld it, cool it off, tack weld it, cool it off. Of course, it's going to be more time consuming. Mm -hmm. So, como aquí no le pasa nada, because aquí tienes un bend. Okay. So, that's why this part doesn't fucking. It doesn't budge whatsoever. Okay. But como aquí no tiene nada de estructura, so mm -hmm. that's why it worked. Yeah. But uh, we're, we, what we got to do, grind all this to bare metal. Yeah. And just hammer and dolly it out 100%. Hay un bottle. It's clear. But it's a dupe cutter. No más lo pides así encima. And it protects it. Yeah. I didn't do no protection on it. So that's why. Ya tiene un año, güey. So it's been a... It's been like that for a year. Yeah. A year or a little bit over it. Over, over a year. A little bit over a year. Shit, like two years. No lie, like two years, I think. Yeah, look, I don't think I say it. We're going to need to re-weld some parts because then it's too big of a gap. Mm -hmm. Yeah, right here. Um, on the I don't know. We're going to put a little more and then we're going to put it. And then we're going to put it. Así para que no se craquee con el mío. No más eso, sí, porque si tiene mucho, like, too big of a gap like that, yeah. it bleeds through, and like, también vas a tener que hacerlo por abajo también. Mm. Hey, we're trying to eliminate that. Así yeah. cuando lo mires por abajo, que se mire así smooth también igual. Mm -hmm. It was worse than what you thought? Yeah, a little bit. Yeah, <laughs> I, I mean, yeah. Well, at the end of the day, you can say that. Oh, yeah, so, ¿tienes un stand ahí, güey? Oh, shit. Yeah, it's fucking heavy. Me falló, me falló un valiente, no, no quise venir. Fuck Lo bueno que tengo que ir el sobrino. Yeah. ¿Está fuerte? Ya? Ah. <laughs> hey, if the toque was heavy, imagine the bed. Uh. Oh, yeah. I can, I can jack the back. No, we can put it under. It's gonna take a little while. One of my first ones. Lo bueno que me chingué los conflays hoy en la mañana porque. I think I see it, yeah. And you can see, this is the same thing, 28, the 
what we end up doing, we actually redid the whole cladding because prior we're just on with just with bondo and ribbons. So what we did, we installed it the correct way. I lined the body, and now you can see 100% straight. I ever seen a how straight it is now. Damn, on 28th, I mean, man? Yeah. It's gonna be yeah. laying the 28th. And then on the aesthetic and the rocker, you know, OEM tiene como pa. Te queda. Te queda hasta aquí la línea. Where it ends up. So what we did, we added more material, and now it's gonna be flush with the cat corner. Okay. So we have we, every gap that we do, we do in the flush. All so I can all straight. Yeah. So don't let it chip. So don't now the gaps are off. And uh, keep in the OEM gap, OEM gap. These you're doing the your brackets, right? Yeah. You say you make your own brackets or something this like one, that. This one and all this one we did. I did all my brackets. The only OEM ones we're using for this one is gonna be the for the rockers, because I don't want him to be riding on the fucking freeway or on the street and then everything fucking happens. Let me put it on. You see, I added it on. I added it with this OEM. Oh, okay. I added the plastic. Welded it shut. So I'm doing the minor, minor body work. And once all this is blocked, just a little bit of filler, block and finesse it a little bit, you never get to tell. Oh, okay. See, come okay. So. Yeah, guys, so if you haven't followed him on Instagram, go ahead. What's your Instagram? Uh, Manos Paint. Uh, that's it. That's all I have. Manos Paint on Instagram. Facebook, Armando Lopez, or my TikTok, Manos Paint 713. Or any questions on SS kits, paddings, wings, custom front ends, the color matching, anything with wheels. Yeah. We, we'll take care of you. <laughs> <laughs> so we just got the bed off. It wasn't that heavy, huh? I thought it was going to be heavier. Honestly, all the sheet metal. I know, yeah. Sheesh. Yeah, we fucking rolled it. 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 We fucking
Hope you like it. It's gonna get worked on finally after two years. And uh, do not forget guys, like, subscribe, hit the bell button for the notification of our newest videos. Any more updates on the work of the bed, do not forget cut the merch, the single cab life dot bigcartel.com. Hope you enjoy the video and I catch you on the next one. Deuce.